NWACP.com, which is here with uh, Mr. Shaka King at the NWACP event. But he's currently doing his work here right now. Look okay, at you going for I'm going for a flight to military field. The collection is heavy in coats, but I didn't want it to be totally weighed down in coats, so I wanted to add other elements with the coats, like the scars and the pants. And one of the skull caps is signature. I hadn't done it for the past four winters just because I was feeling like, oh, well, everybody knows that. So we only use that one kind of cap, but oddly enough, for this collection, it really works. Kind of, really, my inspiration for my collection kind of comes from my father and my uncle. They were very stylish men. They weren't afraid of colors. They weren't afraid of patterns. And why do you think fashion plays a huge role in your community? Well, people look good when they have the opportunity to dress up. I'm from the generation where, I, you know, I just believe that this is part of my uniform. This is what you, this is what you do. And I can understand that young people young people view things a little bit differently, but I, I, I think also when you look around this room and you look at the people here, you can see people here who are equally proud of how they look, and they look good. And this is a fundraiser to support the efforts of the NAACP to improve our community, uh, to deal with alleged discrimination, and to make sure that equal rights are afforded to all of our citizens. Currently we're doing a series of seminars uh, about financial literacy. Jody Thomas, how are you today, Miss Jody? I'm good. Wonderful. Tell us about some of the designs you modeled for today. They were really beautiful. First designer, Nikki, her designs, I love them. Yeah. What's the most difficult situation that you had to overcome in modeling? <laughs> Walking in shoes. They're too big. <laughs> Today I showed a little bit of my spring um, summer 2012 collection and it's called Twisted Daisy. So a few of those like really cute, beautiful, poppy color, lots of like, you know, vibrant things, stuff like this. Um, that's what I started to show off with. Fashion is forever changing. You know, I mean, the wonderful thing about it is that, you know what, it's moving at such a rate where people are not only just enjoying going out, but wanting to keep beautiful and feel put together. Standing here with Mr. Jazzy Faye, how are you today, how sir? How are you doing, brother? Great fashion, great, you know, um, look for for the city, people getting out and having a good time. You know, my man Jazz now. I enjoyed the fashion, it was really nice, and uh, I got a chance to do a little performance tonight. Yeah, man, did real nice. Yeah, definitely, I'm Jazzy and Bond's artist, and uh, what the song I sung was one of the songs from a book called Emmanuel. You know, that, that'll be coming soon, like in February. Um, also, we got um, a TV show, it's called It's a Man's World. So what does this cause do for you in our community? Well, this is the time where all of us as individuals have to understand that we have to work for each other. We can't live lives for ourselves. And, and that's the biggest thing, I think, this economy, this political atmosphere, everything needs to teach us is that we've got to start including other people in our world and including other people in our plans and our thoughts and to really lead a life of service for others.